All right, so one of the things this search engine does really well is to get you to the result you're looking for in the shortest period of time with the least amount of work. So if you enter an ambiguous term, like D-I-A-M-O-N-D-B-A-C-K, diamondback, which could mean a number of different things, the search engine will instantly tell you the different categories into which results from diamondback might fall. Could be diamondback rattlesnakes, it could be diamondback bicycles, it could be a diamondback, a form of insect, it could be diamondback golf equipment, and so on and so forth. And I don't have to type anymore. If I'm looking for diamondback rattlesnake, I simply click on the reptile and amphibian. And I get pictures of the pages so I can tell exactly what I'm looking at. And if I want to change pages, I simply click on the page to change it. If I want to go back, I click on the page to go back. And in this search result on this page, you'll see the search term that I was searching for, diamondback, highlighted in yellow. If I want to actually go to the web page, I can read this little snippet down at the bottom of the page and see if it's the page I want to go to. I just click on it and it will take me to the web page. I can go then, explore the web page, find out the information I want to find out, or if I want to, I can go back to the list and continue on and look at another web page, just like any other search engine. But the difference between this search engine and any other search engine is that you actually get to quickly see if the page is relevant to your search or your query instantly, without having to go to the page, wait for it to load, oh, that's the wrong one, come back, and do it back and forth and back and forth. So it saves you a lot of time. Furthermore, you don't have to type as much information in. Oops, I meant to put an S on Diamondbacks. And guess what came up? Baseball, the number one hit. Click on Baseball, and there I am. Same thing occurs if I click Sporting Goods or if I click any other category in this list. I'm going to instantly go to those search results that are relevant to the search term in the category. I don't have to type in any more than just one word. So if I'm typing in something like Taurus, did I mean Taurus the astrological sign, or did I mean Taurus, Ford Taurus, or did I mean Taurus the astronomical term for Taurus, or did I mean a company like Ford Motor Company that sells Tauruses? Either way, these categories help me to get the results I want with the least amount of typing and in the easiest way possible. But there are some people who like to see the list results because they're used to seeing them and for those people, we do provide an alternate way of looking at it. At the bottom here, there's a little button, and when you click that button, up comes the list view that we're all familiar with seeing, which is the list of search results. If I click on the search results, it's synchronized with the picture view above, and the picture view will turn to the page we're looking at. And I can make them any size I want. The list view is very useful for people who just want to sit down and read it. 